2022, fourth grade, plants. Teachers, we're going to continue our lesson on plants, and we're going to this time use some soil and cups to plant our lima bean seeds. We're going to start with a plastic cup that's clear. It's important that it's clear so it can get sunlight or lamp light. We're going to start with three inches of soil. So have your kids measure three inches up so that they don't waste soil and that they also have enough in there so that when they start to get a stem, you have enough soil to support it. I've measured out enough water. These little blue cups are just perfect. So I poured that in. If you want to, if they want to spray a little bit to get the top damp, that's fine. One other thing on these cups, you need to put a piece of masking tape on here so that you can see their name. Once they have the soil in there, you can't read it. Also make sure you put the date of the day they planted it. So now I'm going to plant three lima beans in this dirt, but I'm going to use my pencils at my lab stations to make my indentions and not necessarily my fingers. The problem is when you have 650 students coming in the lab, you don't have enough paper towels to keep them nice and tidy. So let's not keep wasting our paper towels. I'm going to make sure I have a good lima bean that I soaked overnight to put in there. Let me show you one that's not going to work. This one's broken in half. If this happens and they just plant, this is just nothing. It's not going to become anything. It's just going to rot. It's broken. It needs both sides intact to make it work. So I'm going to plant that one very gently in the middle. You need to encourage them to treat them gently because they are babies. If they poke too hard and break it off, then they're not going to grow. I'm going to make an indention on the side here and drop, oops, sorry, drop me a bean in because I want a viewing bean. I want to see the roots. I want to see the leaves coming out. So these are my viewing beans. And then I'm hoping that the one in the middle becomes my totally successful bean plant. It'll have enough soil to support itself. Then we're going to put these little lids on them, these cups, and that holds your moisture in, holds your humidity in, so that your beans have a chance to sprout and grow. We're going to put them under some plant lights. I have around the room several plant lights with different kinds of bulbs in them. I have a yellow one here, a red one here. I still have an assortment to put up tomorrow. And we're just going to have fun growing under different color lights. And I have one sneaky one I'm putting in on them called plant light. Now, this is important in fourth grade that your students know these are all 60-watt bulbs. So they're all going to get the same amount of heat except for the plant light. It's 65. We'll tell them at the end of the experiment about that one. But we're going to have fun growing these. We're going to keep them in the science labs because you just really don't have room and the lights to keep them going really good in your room. If they're missing a lot of the um, growth of your plant, we'll carry them down to your room on a tray so that the kids can see them. Good luck.